Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson number two on the Linux command line. In this video we're going to be looking at options and arguments which make up the structure of most of the commands that you're going to be using when working with bash or any of these other shells on Linux that we're using. So let's go ahead and take a look at the format of a command. So what it's going to have is it's going to start with the command. So in the last video we looked at commands such as pwd, um, cd, ls, these are your commands. So this is what's going to come first. And now, depending on the command, they're going to have a different number of options, but there's usually multiple options per com command. So these options are going to follow the command immediately afterwards, and they're going to start with a hyphen. Now, I'll show you guys later on how to look up these options and um, so on and so forth. But sometimes options will have arguments that go with them. So you'll have the command, then you'll have hyphen and whatever option you're using and then you're going to give it an argument and now this argument is going to be specific to that option so this can be repeated a multiple number of times so you could have option one um, and then an argument for it and then option two the argument for that and so on and so forth now sometimes there are arguments that don't correspond to a given option but just co correspond to the command itself so in this example we have the command and then however many options, let's say option one, two, three, four, up to X number of options, and then an argument that you give the uh, command. So in some examples down here, we have shutdown hyphen R. Now this is going to take the uh, shutdown command and give it the hyphen R, which will tell the computer to restart. Now right here, we have shutdown hyphen R now. So what this says is restart with the argument now and it's going to do it right away. Below we have the command cd. Now we start with the command cd and then follow it with the argument of forward slash home forward slash john. So that's about it for this video. I just wanted to make a quick one about how commands are structured so that you can get used to uh, figuring out how to work with different options later on on your own and using different arguments. And it's good to start uh, by just knowing how the commands are going to be structured. So thanks guys. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe.